What is going on ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Jay and today I got a quick video for you guys. I promise, I promise this is probably, maybe, possibly the last <laughs> the last filler video for a while after this I'm uh, we're gonna go back to uh, more canon culture of course right after I make that huge announcement video my life kind of just spun out of control but you guys don't want to hear about that today you want to hear about what I have to say about some Kingdom Hearts 3 now I will have to say guys I am NOT the biggest Kingdom Hearts fan out there and I don't I, I don't want you guys to get this misunderstood okay I like Kingdom Hearts. I enjoy Kingdom Hearts. I think it's great. I think it's awesome for what it is. But also, at the same time, I just can't understand what the hell is going on in that story. I just really can't. And honestly, I don't really think anybody else really knows what's going on. Obviously, there's few people here and there and few far and in between that know what's going on with the darkness and friendship and blah 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 whatever the hell may be going on but let's let's be real a lot of people that are into this game are into the cutscenes the final fantasy characters the disney characters let's just let's just be real let's keep it a buck let's keep it a hundred okay because if it wasn't for a lot of those characters nobody would be playing this game i'm just saying because it's definitely not the story that is holding people to actually still playing this the attachment to the characters on the other hand that I, I feel like that is what's really keeping people holding on now now once again I have to reiterate I am a fan of the series I genuinely enjoy the series I've played quite a few of the games and like all the way through like the only ones that I haven't played are the ones that were on completely different systems uh, than the original intended system so uh, you go ahead and do the math on that and see how many games I've played so of course with the collections coming out and everything and Square Enix really trying to push home the budget on this Kingdom Hearts 3 uh, I, I feel like this might be a scenario that is a little bit different from what I always talk smack about which is Final Fantasy 15 now uh, when I was in high school was when when Final Fantasy versus 13 started popping up and we were seeing more and more of that game that was going to be on the PlayStation 3 and it was just it was looking great it was looking like it was going to be a really really just amazing game but obviously fast forward to where we are now and Final Fantasy 15 is what it is and it's just being just treated so oddly like the like the the whole politics surrounding square enix and their games that they make is just so weird it's it's so strange to just see a company that doesn't really stick to their projects very well i mean they're not like ubisoft or anything where the first chance they get they just screw something up but you know i mean that's a little different that's a different topic for a different day but Essentially, my thoughts and opinions on Kingdom Hearts is really it's the cutscenes like between the cutscenes the characters and this and just the characters that you do and don't get attached to um, That's pretty much the glue that holds this series together now Obviously somebody is just going to take this way way too far and be like well Jay You can't really hate on it because you haven't played them all and blah 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 listen listen I'm sure you and your keyboard warrior friends just have plenty of rants to leave in my comment section that I'm not going to pay attention to but I'm gonna tell you guys right now I am 100% very very excited for Kingdom Hearts 3 okay now <sighs> Once again, I'm not excited for the story because I don't really care. It's just another Kingdom Hearts game to me. Whereas, you know, when you play the first game, the second game, and then some of the other ones in between, and then the ones before, and then the ones that take place after, and then there's 2.8, and then those three other games that we really just don't want to mess with. Um, and then there's all those comics, and then all of the online lore that you can read into. You see how this list is going on a lot longer than I really want it to, when all I really wanted to talk about was just the gameplay like that is the only reason why i'm getting it i'm getting it for the gameplay for the awesome cutscenes, for the disney characters now if you're somebody that's you know way deeper into it i'm glad i'm i'm so glad that you enjoy this weird mystical 
thing of a game series of, of, of a franchise really but a lot of the storytelling i don't know if it's just me but um i i feel like a lot of the kingdom hearts stuff is really like hideo kojima like levels of like what the hell is going on like i'm just i'm just genuinely confused and it's just like i i'm having fun playing this game but I, I, what what is going on <laughs> like, like there's just so many so many things going on and really now that I think about it, now that I actually sit here and I'm mid-recording this video, what are the Final Fantasy characters in there for? Like, I'm just, I'm absolutely confused. I understand Cloud takes play, you know, like he has something to do significantly with the main story, especially in the second game. But like, some of the other characters, it just kind of just seems like they're just put there just to be put there. You know, so I'm not saying it's a bad thing. I'm saying I like it. I just would like to see a little bit more. Now, also, I want to raise this question since since we're already talking about Final Fantasy. There is obviously uh, the Big Hero 6 world and, you know, the new Toy Story and, you know, all of these other great Disney properties that are in it. What what do we bring in Final Fantasy to the table? Like, are we going to see lightning? Are we going to see my boy Snow? <gasps> Maybe even Noctis? Could that be a thing? I mean, really, because now that I look at this game and obviously we see more and more of these trailers because now they have like nine, which I don't I don't understand. This game has been hyped up for the past, I don't know how many years now, but it's been forever. You would think like all of the gaming industry knows about Kingdom Hearts. There's no reason to put out this many trailers. And I made the same, the same statement that I made in that Broly video I did last week. There's just too many trailers. <laughs> I don't need this many trailers. Now, obviously with a video game, you get completely different context. There's a lot more content that you're consuming because I think the game is going to be 60 to 80 hours of just like core playtime. So that's like not including side quests and all these other things that you can do but i mean uh, i don't i don't really know what we're gonna get into because the trailers give away quite a bit but obviously because the kingdom hearts story is broken apart the way it is it just seems a little weird now the point i'm really trying to get at here is this game has clearly been in development for a while because i've seen um one of the trailers that is a literal frame for frame cut of one of the scenes out of uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Okay, now just bear with me here. Just just open your mind a little bit. Think about this. If this game was being developed back when that Pirates of the Caribbean was popular at World's End, okay, that was that's been a minute okay i don't know if y'all know this but time seems to go forward and references don't seem to make the same impact that they used to so i'm wondering if we're gonna see the incredibles um and i say that only because since it's only fairly recent that it's become even more popular than it's ever been um then there's inside out there's just wreck it ralph there's just so many other things which i'm surprised wreck it ralph made it in there so well i'm very interested to see where that goes but essentially i just posed the question what other disney properties do you guys think is going to be in there i would ask you what you want but i mean at this point the game's finished like there's no speculation i don't i'm not I'm hyped for it, but I'm also not hyped because it's just like, ugh, $60 and I gotta turn on my PlayStation. But you guys know me. I have a jaded view about certain things and nobody really asked me my opinion because I'm just a nigga with, with almost 6,000 subs, okay? Ain't nobody asked me what I wanted in a video game or, or anything like that. So I don't understand. I just don't have a, a, a leg to stand on. But I do want to turn the question to you. What do you guys think? Like, how many of you guys are actually hyped for Kingdom Hearts 3? And if you are, are you following the story? Like, do you actually know what's going on? Or is it something that you're hey, you kind of know about? Like, like, be honest. If you're one of those people who's just kind of softcore with it, like, I, I, know, I understand the general idea of what's going on, then please tell me, I wanna know. But if you're somebody who's on the other end and you're super hardcore, I would like to ask that you don't leave a comment just so that way you don't ruin it for everybody else because you know how some of you people be. You guys just ruin everything on the internet. I just, but that's, once again, nobody asked me my opinion, but uh, I gave it anyway. Anyway, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that like button. Also, memberships are now available so you guys can get behind the scenes stuff basically every single week. I'm putting out new content every single week specifically for sponsors and memberships uh, so you guys can be a part of that. 
um there is a link for that down in the description section so you guys can go ahead and do that that will be awesome make sure to like today's video if you enjoyed it this has been your boy jay sama and i will catch you guys in an actual video i swear i swear at some point i don't know when it's going to be make sure to keep it canon